Hey everybody, Brian here, aka The Farmer's Life. Thought I would throw my quadcopter up in the air while I was loading a truck the other day. Show you how grain gets out of a bin, up the leg, and down into the truck so we can haul it away. Let's take a look. So we're down here on the ground. First thing you might notice, right dead center, is that white box with all the buttons on it. That's our control panel for all the electric motors. Uh, turns on the leg. A lot of the motors there that run into the leg won't turn on unless the leg is on, which is a good thing. The bin we're loading out of is just to the right of the little white shed there. That's our tester house where we keep a grain moisture tester and a few other things. So grain's going to be coming through the pipe that's there on the ground in front of that little shed. Goes from the bin, dumps over into the leg, a belt with a whole bunch of plastic buckets on it hauls corn up to the top of the leg which we're going to see now so the legs there next to the red platform on the right the two pieces of square tube with the ladder up the center going up higher than the grain bins when we get to the top of the leg you'll see all the pipes come up there to a turn head we have a handle down on the ground attached to a pipe turn the handle the right way dumps into the right bin or as we're doing here, goes to the downspout, dumps in a truck. That's the same spout that actually fills bin 1. So there is another valve on top of bin 1 that will divert grain past bin 1 and into the downspout and into the truck like it's doing right now. Fly down a little bit. Take a closer look at the truck, see what's going on there. I'm just about done with this load of corn. You see I'm just about full there in the back hopper. Just for fun, go take a closer look. So there's ladders on the front and the back of the trailer. I can go look and see how full it is. But after you load a whole bunch, you don't always have to do that. Especially this bin loads out kind of slow so it doesn't pile up too fast on you. There's an air gauge on the side of the truck that's attached to the air suspension on the truck. So when that gauge gets to the right number, I know I've got the right weight on the truck. I'll be a little over 80,000 pounds here, grain trailer and truck all together. Fly back up, get a look at the whole thing here. All of our bins here at the home farm. And just about got a truck loaded. Thanks for watching.